The Indian Air Force will participate in air combat exercises alongside F-35 fifth generation fighters for the first time in 2025. A Russian think tank has raised concerns about the potential cyber security risks associated with American fighter jets, specifically warning that these aircraft could be equipped with backdoor Trojans, potentially allowing for unauthorized access or control. The Border Security Force has initiated a special electronic surveillance project to secure over 600 vulnerable patches along the India-Pakistan and India-Bangladesh borders. Astaya Aerospace has reached a major milestone by delivering its largest ever contract of 80 15 vertical takeoff and landing drones to the Indian Army. The Tartu Airbus facility will support the production of 18,000 aircraft parts indigenously, creating immense opportunities for micro small and medium enterprises to engage in the supply chain. Garden Reach Shipbuilders has signed a contract with a German firm for the construction and delivery of sixth multi-purpose vessel. After success with supply orders to Mauritius and Myanmar, Goa Shipyard Limited is now targeting the Latin American market to expand its export footprint. Zeus Numerics has showcased its cutting-edge munitions and innovative solutions like UAV weaponization kit to the Saudi military. Mohindra is working on counter drone solutions for civilian and defense applications. A senior official from General Electric India has said that the DRDO has expressed a desire for a sixth generation engine, and such an achievement would likely require the incorporation of adaptive cycle engine technology, exemplified by General Electric's cutting edge XA100 engine. General Electric has completed the fourth series of testing on this revolutionary XA100 engine, while Rolls Royce and Safran are at least 15 years behind. General Electric has offered to co-develop a new 130 kilonewton engine for the AMCA program, that would meet India's immediate requirements for the AMCA, but it would not incorporate the advanced adaptive cycle features that the DRDO might be seeking for future proofing the 5.5 generation AMCA platform. He also said, that for collaborating on developing a next generation adaptive cycle engine, India would require considerable financial and technological investment. Solar Industries is undertaking significant refinement of its Bhagavastra vehicle mounted counter swarm drone system to meet the Indian Army's evolving requirements. While the system remains in its pre production stage, Solar Industries has said that it could take one to two years to materialize completely. The system boasts an impressive detection range of over 5 kilometers, even for targets with a radar cross-section as small as 0.01 square meters. Once threats are detected, the Bhagavast track can lock onto and neutralize targets in under 16 seconds. It is capable of simultaneously tracking and engaging up to 64 targets, demonstrating its efficacy in handling large-scale swarm attacks. Hindustan Aeronautics has said that the Cats Warrior is under fabrication, and it will have an ambitious target price of under $5 million, so that it can be produced in large quantities. The Cats Warrior is designed to operate autonomously at altitudes of 36,000 to 40,000 feet, and can target aerial threats such as drones, UAVs and attack helicopters with air-to-air -air missiles, and will be armed with smart anti-airfield weapon for precision strikes on enemy infrastructure and defenses. Today's Top 3 Comments